Hey guys, happy Tuesday. So I hope you all are having an amazing day. It's almost five o'clock here in California. So I'm sure most of your work days are almost over. So I hope you guys have had an amazing day and an amazing start to your week. As you guys are coming on, please say hello. Let us know where you are watching from. I am coming to you live from beautiful, cool California. Mark is not on here with me. He's actually like fixing, we bought a mattress pad today for our bed at Costco. So he is getting that put on while I come on here and give you guys some tips and tricks. So we are live over here on YouTube. Make sure you guys say hello on YouTube. Also make sure you hit that subscribe button so you guys get notified when we go live over here. And we are also live over here on Facebook. Hello friends, thank you guys so much for jumping on. Hey Trish, hey Teresa, hey Linda, hey Cindy, hey Wendy, hey Thomas. Thank you guys for all jumping on on this beautiful Tuesday. Let me know where you are watching from. I know the weather has been kind of crazy. It actually heated up here today. So it's in the 80s. So I know summer is coming. I'm super excited. As soon as we get off of here, I think I'm going to go for a walk. Try to get like my blood going. Get a little bit of sunshine because I have been inside working all day. Thank you guys for saying hello. So if you are um, not catching us live, that means this red box is not up on either Facebook or YouTube. Make sure that you put missed you in the comments because I definitely missed you and I wanna reach out and connect. And also, if you are new, welcome. Super excited that you found your way to our page. Please put new in the comments. And if you can, let me know where you found us. Did you find us on YouTube? We're doing a lot of stuff over on YouTube Shorts. Are you finding us here on Facebook? We are doing live cookings and um, reels to help like support you guys. So let us know where you found us or maybe it was Pinterest, Instagram, TikTok, because we are on all platforms. Welcome Sandy Kogan. She says she is new. Hey, Linda from Kentucky and hey, Joan, thank you for jumping on. So I don't wanna keep you guys very long. Do me one more favor. Remember sharing is caring. It helps us to reach more people and helps us to fulfill our passion of helping people to get healthy and live happy lives. And I'm sure somebody shared us out when you found us. So if you can do me a favor and share it with somebody that you love, this is gonna be very valuable. I'm just gonna give you a couple tips on how you can extend your life, how you can live longer. Three easy, quick tips. We won't be on here long. Make sure you share it, put shared in the comments. And I will get you guys into the drawing. Brenda says she found us on Facebook. Fantastic. Hey, Linda. Zykvoss? Okay, wait a second. That went by too fast and I did not see it. So I hope I... Linda Z. We'll call you Linda Z. And Jackie says she found... Janice says on Facebook. Okay, perfect. And Janice also said thank you or shared. So thank you, Janice, for sharing. So you guys, I want to get started super quick. I have three tips for you, okay? Three super easy tips that you can do to help increase your lifespan and live longer. Tip number one, protect, prioritize self-care. So tip number one, you guys, is to prioritize your self-care. So if you're like me, I schedule everything out on Sunday. It's always helped me just to feel like I'm conquering my week, I'm organized, and I'm just getting a good head start. I find whenever I don't schedule things out, I get a little bit, you know, discombobulated. Schedule it out. The first thing that I schedule in my week, you guys, is me time. Whether it's date night with Mark, or if it's podcasts that I want to listen to, or if it's going for a walk, it is super important to prioritize your self-care. Self-care. Right now, with the way things are on Insta on social media, okay, we are all consumed in that. It seems like we're scrolling. We're, we're just not taking the time for us like we used to. Read a book. Find a good book, read a book. If you love listening to music, crank up that music and dance in your kitchen, okay? I know that I really enjoy going on long trips and I realize it's because I listen to the radio and I sing and my mind's not in other things. I'm taking time for myself. So make sure that you prioritize your self-care. Schedule in the things that make you happy and fill your cup because whenever you're doing those things, whether it's spending time with family, whether it's date night with your husband, that is going to make you so excited, give you so much energy to where you're going to be able just to conquer your week. So that's tip number one, prioritize self-care. Tip number two is balanced nutrition. This is really important, you guys. In the busy age that we live in right now, it's super easy and convenient just to grab and go. 
grab and go. Unfortunately, when we do that, those nutrients are not what are really good for our bodies, not really what's good for our mood, not really what's good for us to be able to perform our best. So stick with whole foods. It goes back to the planning. Like I said, on Sunday, I will plan stuff out. Sit down on Sunday and just write out a meal plan. You guys, just something super quick. What are you gonna do for breakfast for the week? What are you gonna do for lunch? If you have it already made up and packed to where you can grab it, it's gonna help you to stay balanced and you're gonna be amazed at how much better you feel when you stick with whole foods. Super simple, you guys. Pick a protein, pick a vegetable, pick a fat. Stay away from the high sugary processed foods. Stay away from the grab and go. So prioritize self-care and balanced nutrition. Tip number three, you guys. Oh, and let's go back to balanced nutrition really fast. If you need meal plans, if you are not already in our group and you need meal plans, put meal plans in the comments so I can get you added and also send me a direct message so I can put you in our group. We have tons of meal plans in there, you guys. We have keto meal plans. We have vegan meal plans. We have just high protein. We have low carb. Anything you need to help plan a healthy week, we've got for you. So put meal plans in there, send me a friend request and a direct message and I will get you in. Here we go. Tip number three. This one here is for me. Regular activity. You guys, if we don't move our bodies, we are really doing ourselves a disservice. They say that if you get less than 2,000 steps a day, okay? Less than 2,000, which I think is a mile. Not quite sure, but less than 2,000. You are decreasing your lifespan by 20%. Yeah, think about that. By just moving, being sedentary, and not moving over 2,000, you're decreasing. And it doesn't cost anything to get out and move, you guys, to get over 2,000 steps. Aim for 7,500 steps a day. They say if you get 7,500 steps a day, it increases your lifespan by 20%. So look at the difference just by getting movement in. Do things that you enjoy. Maybe play pickleball, okay? I know I used to like to do that, but it's a little competitive. Maybe if you like to play golf. Maybe if you just need to like, I, we are gonna do right now, go out after dinner and just go for a nice leisurely stroll and get those steps in. By doing regular activity, you are gonna increase your lifespan. So that's my three tips for you guys. Super simple. It is so important to focus on your health. And sometimes whenever we get really busy, we don't even think about the simple things that we can do. The simple things as far as prioritizing self-care, making sure that you are focusing on you. Listen to music, listen to a podcast, listen to things that are gonna change your mood. Put down the phone, stop the scroll, because I can promise you that that really does get into your head and it is not good for your self-care. It's not good for your mental health. There, the depression is on the rise, anxiety is on the rise, and I really think it's because we don't simplify things and just do things that make us happy. Listen to music, listen to a podcast, read a book, prioritize your self-care, and make sure that you are scheduling in time for you and your family because I know how happy it makes me whenever I'm spending time with people that I love and that will fill your cup too. So number two is balance neutral. Don't go for the quick grab and go. Whenever you plan things out, you are more likely to stay on track. So make out a plan and if you need help with the meal plan, make sure that you put meal plan in the comments. I will send you a meal plan. You guys also make sure that you send me a friend request and you can always go to teamterryketo.com. We have all of our recipes. Plan out your week. And finally, tip number three is regular activity. Move friends, move. If you don't, if you get less than 2,000 steps a day, you're decreasing your lifespan by 20%. If you get over 7,500 steps a day, you are increasing it by 20%. I know I want to live 20% longer, so I'm going to make sure that I get my 7,500 steps in a day and then just do some activities that I love. So I appreciate you guys all jumping on with me on the Tuesday. I hope these Tuesday tips are helping you guys. Just little simple things that you can do to make your life 1% better, increase your lifespan, and you can live a healthier, happier life. Your family, your friends, they all deserve a healthy, happy you. So make sure if you get value from this, you put value in the comments, smash on that love button, and share it with somebody that you guys love. So I appreciate you so much for jumping on here. I am going off for a walk. I hope you guys have a nice day 
amazing evening. I will see you. I think tomorrow night we'll be, be on here for um, some type of keto kitchen. And if you missed our keto kitchen last night, make sure you jump over because I ate those today for lunch. The blueberry ice cream bites. Oh my gosh, they're so good. They're so good. So make sure you jump over there, grab that recipe and let me know if you make it. Love you guys. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.